Okay, and now just in the interest of saving a little bit of time for y'all, I am going to do all of my affirmative usted and ustedes commands at the same time, but I am going to pay close attention to make sure that I can actually, um, that I'm using the E or the EN or the A and the AN um, correctly. So if it's ustedes, it's obviously going to have an N at the end of it. If it's usted, it's just going to have that vowel. Okay, so Eduardo y Ana, and it's an affirmative command, so escuchen. How do I know that? It's an AR verb, so it needs to be the opposite ending. And escuchar is a normal verb. Guardar um, is an AR verb, it's usted, so it's going to be guarda. This one is escoger. This is another tricky one. If it's a G-E-R or a G-I-R verb that's preceded by a vowel, it's going to get a J-O in the yo form. So escojan, super crazy, right? Escojan, and again, this was an E-R verb, and now it's got an A, so I'm good to go. Uh, let's see. This one is a stem changer and an I-R verb. Repitan. Maria and Laura, um, it's an ustedes command. It's a go verb, so it's going to be agan. Uh, next up, Senora Ramirez, tome. Um, now, native speakers would probably want to write tomele. The al kind of includes that, so it's totally fine if you do, but I would give you credit if you just said tome. Okay? Your choice. Um, niños, ustedes. So that's going to be laven is the command, right? For lavar. It's affirmative, so I'm going to attach se, the reflexive pronoun for the bottom right chart of the box, the bottom right box of the chart. Uh, so laven se, count back. And there's my accent, la vence. Next one, usted, again, it's a G-E-R, uh, escoja. Next one, ustedes, I'm going to tell you to cut it, as in cut the, gar uh, the grass. L becomes low for this one, okay? I don't know if that one got a little too shiny. L becomes low. And then, so that's going to be corten, low. And then I have to add an accent. And I literally did that in a spot where I had another letter. So hopefully y'all can see that cortenlo. Okay. And then um, this one is negative, so I'm going to skip it. Ustedes is positive again. So I'm telling y'all to listen to me. Again, it's an affirmative command. It's an AR verb. So escuchen me because you're listening to me. So that's done. And I have to add an accent. Escuchen me. And then the last one is negative, so that's it for that one.